subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Title, Installing Zlib in Python, a step-by-step -step tutorial. Introduction Zlib is a widely used software library for data compression. In Python, Zlib is commonly used for compressing and decompressing data. This tutorial will guide you through the process of installing the Zlib library in Python, using code examples to demonstrate its usage. Step 1, Ensure Python is installed. Before installing Zlib, make sure you have Python installed on your system. You can download Python from the official website, https colon slash slash www.python.org slash downloads, and follow the installation instructions for your operating system. Step 2, Install Zlib via pip. Open your terminal or command prompt and run the following command to install the Zlib library using pip, the Python package installer. This command will download and install the Zlib library along with its dependencies. Step 3, Verify Installation. Once the installation is complete, you can verify that Zlib is installed correctly by opening a Python interpreter and importing the Zlib module. This code snippet imports the Zlib module and prints the version information to ensure that the installation was successful. Step 4, Using Zlib for Data Compression. Now that Zlib is installed, let's explore a simple example of compressing and decompressing data using Zlib. In this example, we create a byte string original underscore data, compress it using zlib.compress, and then decompress it using zlib.decompress. The decompressed data is then printed to the console. Conclusion Congratulations! You have successfully installed the Zlib library in Python and learned how to use it for data compression and decompression. Feel free to explore more advanced features of Zlib as needed for your projects. ChatGPT